In this chapter, we'll review removing vocals. So let's start by opening Audacity, and a new Audacity window opens. So let's say you want to remove vocals to create a karaoke track of a song. You go to Project, and Import Audio. Then select a song, and I'm going to make the note here that most songs are copyrighted. So you want to be very careful what you do with them. You can't just post them on the web or use them in public without copyright permission. So I'm not here to give legal advice, but do be careful what you do. So let me select some of the song here, zoom in a little bit, and find some audio and vocals. So I'm going to take this portion right there. I think there's vocals there. Let's see. <laughs> Okay, that's a little short. Let's take a little bit longer to play with. And try again. Okay, that'll do. I'm also picking this song because it's a song I can actually sing with. So let's take this portion of the audio and click Copy. And I'm going to open up a new project. And I'll paste it in here. And here's our audio again. Okay, there we have it. Some fairly easy vocals for me to replace. So what we do here is go up by the track, click on the arrow, and from the drop-down menu, select Split Stereo Track. Now for this example, the audio is going to be balanced on both tracks. Sometimes you'll have audio just on one track, and you can find that out by clicking solo and playing on it. But here we have it on both. So now I'll highlight the right track, or the bottom track. You see how the top track goes to light gray. I'll go up to Effect, and from the drop-down menu, I'll select Invert. And now this track has been inverted. Then, go back to the arrow, select mono, go up to the left track and do the same, select mono, and now I'll click play. And there you can hear the audio has canceled itself out. So now you can use it as a karaoke track. You would save the track, I'll put in a new folder called Karaoke. And give it a name. And then click Save. And then if I want to add my own vocals to it, I go up to Project, select New Audio Track, and then click Record. medical expenses, property damage, for a car they didn't even own. Now you see why I'm not a singer. So there we have our recorded track, and now I can play it back. Medical expenses, property damage, for a car they didn't even own. Well, I don't know if I'll be hitting the Billboard Top 10, but there you have an idea if I want to record this and make it my own, that's how you do it. And that's how you remove and replace vocals in Audacity.